When Daniel Rocha walked into this dealership in Prosper, he never thought he'd walk out in legal trouble. It happened here and within minutes of test driving a truck, he was pulled over by police. When he stopped me, uh, he asked for my driver's license and, and he says the reason why I stopped you is because uh, you don't have uh, a license plate in the back. Rocha got this citation for operating a vehicle without license plates. But hear what he says the officer told him once he stepped out of the truck. He said, this has been ongoing with these dealers and we've been getting on these guys for doing that. We reached out to Prosper Police. Failure to properly display dealer tags on test-driven vehicles is a violation of Texas law. It's the vehicle operator who is responsible. The Prosper Police Department urges all car dealerships to comply with these regulations to ensure the safety of their customers and prevent future violations. He says, well, in order for us to make them abide, we're going to start citing the customers. Longo Toyota of Prosper tells us it's only happened to them once. We recently became aware of an issue during a test drive, which we are actively working to address and resolve. Driver safety is a core value for us. Rocha tells us the dealership did offer to reimburse him for the ticket, but he also says they discounted the cost of the ticket off the vehicle estimate. The general manager denies that happened. It does upset me that, you know, I'm, I'm in the middle of this feud that's going on. You know, Rocha did not that buy that truck, even though he really needed one. I lost my son in a, in, a, in a car accident. His son, Daniel Jr., died on August 30th. <laughs> that, was, that was my truck. He was 44 years old with a family. I would rather have my son here, but... This is the last thing the Roaches need right now. A citation and a court date for something they're not responsible for. I'm just looking for a vehicle. In Prosper. I'm Joe Bintonico.